So Shad, back to the uh, back to the share this weekend. Are you looking forward to it? Yeah, definitely, mate. Yeah, ever since I heard the draw, probably a month or so ago. Now it's yeah, you know, been been a game I've been looking forward to without doubt. Talking to a few of the boys yesterday, and they said there's, there's been a bit of communication between you and them. Now they've been a bit of banter flying back and forth. Ah, uh, yeah, there's been a few text messages and things like that. So, yeah, still got a lot of good mates there, and um, you know, so it's going to be be a good challenge to play against them. Yeah, you know, it's an exciting game for me, definitely. And uh, you know, yeah, it's been a bit of banner, and but that's all all fun before the game. Yeah, Shad were a brilliant player for us. I mean, he was possibly the, the best player in the competition and, and it shows how, how, how good he is by how well he's done at Bradford I mean you can never underestimate Shaddy can score from anywhere he's a world class player Luckily I got to leave on a high and, you know, but this year's been a new challenge for me and you know, it's exciting to, to go back there all the fans and the club were, were always good to me so you know, hopefully uh, I don't get too cold a reception that, you know, but you know, it's an exciting, exciting game for me all right, so obviously a massive game for the club of the weekend. You must be really looking forward to it. Yeah, mate. Uh, you know, rivalry clubs. You know, Bradford versus Halifax. Um, you know, it's going to be a good day, and I know both clubs are expecting you know to have a big crowd here. So, um, you know, it, it's something we're all looking forward to, and I, I just can't wait to get out there. Do you think you guys might find it a little bit tricky in terms of motivation? You know, coming up against a so-called lesser opposition. You know, they are a league lower than you guys. No, I don't think so. I think we uh, we want to build some form. So I think. Uh, you know, we'll take uh, we'll take this game very seriously, and um, you know we, we haven't been playing the best of footy the last few weeks, so we want to uh, really improve. So hopefully we can do it this weekend. No, it's never hard to motivate yourself against the Bulls. It's, it's a local derby. It's massive for the town. It's massive for the club. I mean, preparations all week are going to be around this game. It's going to be a sellout. It's going to be a great occasion, and, and, and just can't wait for the game. Yeah, that's that's one good thing about the Challenge Cup. It gives you a break from your league season. Yeah, if you uh, aren't doing too well, which both teams aren't really. We've both had a hot and cold season so far, so yeah, you know, it gives you a chance to regroup and focus on something else for a week, and uh, you know, and then hopefully you can t- you take some form out of this game and take it back into the league with you. So you know, there's a chance to do that, but the focus is on this week at the moment, and we've got a job to do. Go go on there. They're going to give us a hard game. They've got a few injuries like ourselves, so you know they've been on down on form, and, and same as us, but. Games like these, you know, form doesn't mean nothing. You know, you, you turn up on the day and, like I said, it's Challenge Cup and, and like I said, it's it's a rivalry game. Bradford versus Halifax, nothing better. So, you know, both teams are going to be up for it and, and it's going to be a good game. What in particular have you been working on, you know, because obviously you've got to try and put, fix things up a little bit. Is there any areas you've been concentrating on in training? Uh, yeah, just sort of today we've been doing a little bit of uh, kicking and kick shape, so I hopefully we improve that and uh, also just... Um, you know, our shape, uh, our shape just in general play, so hopefully it comes together. You can never underestimate Bradford. I mean, they're, they're a great side on the day. They've got great players. They've got world-class players throughout the squad. Uh, I mean, if we prepare properly and, and, and do everything the way we should, we'll, we'll give them a fair crack. You know, we've got players that can do you know, a lot of spark in their team, so you know, it's going to come together soon, and, and hopefully this Saturday, I mean, on Sunday, it's going to be the day where we click into form and, and you know, overturn Bradford. For a, a local... Uh, Bradford Halifax Derby. If you if you, the players aren't up for it, then there's something wrong with them. It's going to be a big occasion. It's a big occasion for the fans. You know they haven't they haven't played each other for for a number of years, and you know when when that when the shade's full and both both teams are singing, it's going to be a exciting day. You know, and uh, and I think all the players are definitely looking forward to it. It's going to be ferocious. You know, we we had a friendly at the start of the year, and you know it was it's the same as this game. We you know we battled to the death and. Uh, you know, it's going to be it's going to be one hell of a game. You know, it's going to be battered and bruised people afterwards. So, you know, everyone's going to give 110 percent and and make the better team win. You've been giving the boys and Mick Potts of the inside track there and your former teammates. Ah, uh, I might have tried to tip him up on a few things, but you know, uh, Mick and the rest of the coaches do their homework pretty well. So, there's not much I can tell them that they don't really know already. Yeah.